So today we're going to talk about changing customary units. Sometimes this can get confusing, but I want to um, explain both ways. Um, so let's say we've got 20 quarts and we want to change that to pints. So we know from the table that it gave us that one quart equals two pints. So maybe this picture can break it down a little bit better. So I have one quart, this whole thing's one quart, or I have two pints. If I look over here, I know I have 20 quarts. So I have 20 of these, but I'm changing it to pints, which is smaller. Well, I know two of these make up that one. And so I'm going to multiply my 20 quarts by two, which ends up being 40. And we know we're trying to change it to pints. So that's going to be 40 pints. It's the same thing, 20 quarts is equal to 40 pints. So if I draw that in my squares, so 40 pints. So I've got two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40. So that's 40 total pints all the way through here. But remember, each one of these is a quart. So I've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20 quarts. So 20 quarts, 40 pints.